when you see uh, what Mike was able to do last season and kind of with the Hoops team, what did you see that reinforced to you that, that he was the right guy for the job? And what do you see as the immediate future for Penn State men's basketball? Yeah, let me take the, the, the last part. I mean, I, I think the sky's the limit. I think what Micah Shrewsbury and his staff and, and the guys did um, this year was pretty amazing. Um, you think about the timeline uh, for he and the staff to keep guys from transferring, bring in some transfers, maybe even the most amazing thing, the, the, the recruiting class that he signed, that they signed in, in November that will, will be here soon. Um, then we go through the season, you see the way, <clears throat> excuse me, see the way the guys bought in. Uh, and the way they played, they played so, so, so hard in a program that's always been known for, for, for the guys playing hard. But I think uh, Micah took it, uh, Micah and the guys took it to, to a new level. And I'm, um, I'm really excited uh, to, to watch what they'll do. I mean, just the enthusiasm with the tournament run and uh, the Big Ten tournament run uh, and, and the, the kind of outpouring of support and, and, and love from the guys to Micah, Micah to the guys from our, our uh, Penn State uh, men's basketball enthusiast. And, and uh, it, you know, uh, hard to believe we were three games under, under 500 and, and feeling that good. Now, remember, we missed three games due to COVID. We could have been, we fairly easily could have been 500. Uh, but uh, I, I, sky's the limit. I think Micah Shrewsbury is going to do great things um, at Penn State. Um, I was obviously very bullish on Micah when we hired him, um, uh, and, and I'm even more so now.